I wanted to bring up uh, uh, something just because um, Phil Kessel, buddy with him, and that the the preseason game in Toronto, um, where you've talked about. I, I saw a couple of your interviews where you never really, you said you never really were angry. You never. It took a lot to get you where you're like actually pissed off. Um, yeah, and you were pissed off that day. Yeah, at that game. Well, I was pissed that I think Jamie Devane might have played for Philadelphia. Uh, I. Maybe he played for Pittsburgh. I can't remember. But I was pissed at him. I was pissed at the whole Leafs organization, that whole team. Just because before that game, it was preseason, Toronto had a tough team, right? They they had Orr and McLaren and that Devane and Frazier on the back end, Troy Bode. It was a tough team. And Buffalo, we had myself. That was it, really. Patrick Coletta, who's not really a fighter. Steve mm-hmm. Ott, who just gets – he tries. So – before the game, I tell all the guys in Toronto, I'm like, if you're looking for a fight, just you know, come and ask me. I'll, I'll fight you. Lo and behold, one of their tough guys grabs a small guy, Corey Trop, beats him up bad. Either scraping him up off the ice. As they're doing that, I'm fuming. I'm screaming at Randy Carlisle. I'm like, you fat piece of beepy, like just giving it to him. <laughs> and I'm, we're going back and forth. And finally, I said, Randy, and we were the away team. So I'm like, whoever you put out, I'm putting in the hospital. So put someone out. And he had his choice of tough guys. It was preseason. You dress two or three right. tough guys every preseason game. Mm-hmm. And so I'm waiting. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. And I see him give me this little grin, like, okay, here you go. And he puts Phil Kessel um, and a couple of his first line guys out. And I'm just like, come on. And so I'm thinking, what do I got to do? I'm going to, you know, he's challenging me to fight Phil Kessel apparently. And so I said, I'm going to do it. Screw it. Let's go. I tell my centerman, I'm like, I'm going to jump Phil heads up. (laughs) Phil comes over, looks at me. I look at him. I played against him for years. I said, Phil, I'm going to jump you, man. I'm sorry. He looks at me and he goes, what? The puck drops and I shed my mitts and then he starts hacking away and the rest is history. But it's, I blame Carlisle. He just, yeah, of course. hundred percent. What was he thinking? Because yeah. he thinks I'm not going to jump Phil. It's preseason. Yeah. I don't care about that. Like, let's go. Yeah. Yeah. So it was a funny thing. But yeah, everybody hates what? me now because I go after skill guys. So oh, well, yeah. I would do it fun- again. The funny thing is, as uh, I grew up, my my dad was the uh, trainer with the Flyers when I was a kid. So I grew up, you know, around the Flyers. And one of my good buddies, our good buddies, is uh, Craig Baruby, and uh-huh. he he was the king of. As he got was more established in the league. I mean, he's got a few stories where uh was the guy that Dale Purrington and yeah, Purrington. Oh. He went over to he went over to Leach and he says, if this guy doesn't stop running the fuck around, I'm gonna grab you and beat the fuck out of you. <laughs> and that, he grabbed he grabbed Zubov one night. He grabbed Zubov one night and pounded <clears throat> him in New York. No he said, way. Gonna, yeah, yeah. And he there was another story where that Aaron Downey was running around and he something happened in the game and he told Mike Madano he goes we play you next week and I'm gonna kill you if you don't like it. he said this is the God's honest truth I don't I, this is what Chief said he said they played next week and Aaron Downey he said skated the red line and apologized to every single player oh, yeah. on Calgary's team I'm sure swear to God it's what Chief said so but it's funny no. you did that but like guys don't fuck around after like. I, well, I can't yeah. blame you. I, I love Phil, but like he got uh, he got out of that he one. Can blame he his coach. I don't know he how got he got out of that one. So I mean, he been safe. Probably. Oh, if I would have grabbed him, I would have broke his face. He would have never oh. had the Iron Man streak ever. No, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's a great point. Yeah, that's great a really good point. point. I can just see it when you when you said it to him. What? What are you talking about? Fuck off! Oh, like, man. He's like no way. I've I'm never grabbed. I've never had him. I had a conversation with him afterwards. I, I tracked down his number. I play with Joe Pavelski and they were friends. And like, I, t- I started texting him and he kind of ghosted me. I-, I think he's still upset about the whole situation. He should but be mad he- at Carlisle. Not yeah, you. Yeah, he should be mad at Carlisle. Carlisle. The funny thing is, I'm the only one who didn't get suspended out of that whole thing. I didn't get anything. Phil got a couple games. Clarkson got 10 games. Everybody got suspended except oh, wow. for me. It's funny. Were you, I, were you so pissed off? Did you feel him chopping you? chopping you no, down? No, not at all. No, you didn't feel it. I saw the, that was just when Twitter was starting and after the game, everyone's like, look at this. How's your legs? Are you bruised? You're this and that. It's like, you can't no. feel anything. Once yeah, you're in the yeah. heat of it, I'm getting piled on by all these guys. It's oh just, my God. I know. 
No, Didn't you it was... scream you were bleeding or something? Didn't you? Like, well, because I to... wanted to get up and start yeah. fighting because I had the ref and three guys. And so I was like, I'm bleeding pretty bad. Get off of me. <laughs> just to, so I could get up to try to engage somebody. But no, they... yeah, I was I was oh. screaming. <laughs> so yeah, dumb. That's awesome. Oh, it's man. So dumb. That's funny. I just can't believe a coach. <laughs> You know, you said even though it's preseason, but even more a reason to put, you know, throw out your your tough guys to just to, to try and defuse this thing. But I like, know. throw out Phil Castle. I just I just can't for the life of me understand. Oh, and I was that. calling him everything you can imagine. I was like, Randy, you fat like just everything. You chicken shit yeah. like right like just and he just puts out Kessel. I was I I couldn't believe it. So yeah, what are you gonna do? Bluff. Yeah, yeah right. That's, that's yeah, don't sure. play poker with me. I, I yeah. never get bluffed. <laughs> oh man, I lose all my money, but you can't bluff me. 